It's, it's, it's someone's third, birthday. Um, it is. So we're going to. Somewhere gonna, around the world. Somewhere. Okay. So what do we got here? So I was thinking we just had something savory. You think in dessert? You feeling that? Why wouldn't I? These are top secret red velvet cupcakes. Top secret. <laughs> so uh, it's a classic, it's a staple, red yeah. velvet. Um, but normally, uh, to make red velvet cake, you want that, that bright red color, you would use tons of artificial food dye, artificial food color. And there's something in here to give it that red, vibrant color Beach. that you would not expect. Beach. Okay. No. That, that is it. <laughs> Is it really beets? It is, it is beets. Uh, well, Cause you, I mean, I love it there. The best part is beets are incredibly healthy, but mm -hmm. you know, the color is really what gave away. Not that I taste beets, cause this mm -hmm. tastes you like don't. this velvet cake. Yeah. Because I hate beets. Me too. I but I love this. Them. How about the frosting? That's so the true. frosting is also really simple and really healthy. There's only uh, four ingredients in it. Uh, just some uh, coconut butter, uh, almond oil. Coconut. Mm -hmm. coconut butter, almond oil, maple syrup, and then some vanilla. And that's all nice. that's in the frosting. The frosting is really good. The frosting is it's really good. And it it tastes like it's healthy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And actually, with the beets, when you roast them, uh, you're kind of cutting out some of the bitterness that you'd usually associate with beets, and it brings out those natural kind of sugars that are in there. And so then you put them in a food processor, and all of that, those red pigments in the beets, kind of come out into the cupcake.